let me do it. Ow! Hey guys! Hello! Welcome! I literally got out of the shower like five minutes ago. Like, honestly, like five minutes ago. So just give me a minute to get through this. Put a little, little something, something up, up in my hair. Up in my hair. Okay, now I'm gonna post this to my live wall. So come in, say hey, say hello. Sorry, but if I don't do this now, if I don't like straighten these pieces right now, they're gonna be like so frizzy, it's not even gonna be funny. So you girls just gotta do what a girl's gotta do, right? Come in and say hi. Come in and say hi. Come in and say hi. Hello, everybody. Let me pin my sides. Go. Let me share this to my wall. Hey, Debbie. Well, let me turn these. Um, sorry, I had to turn my volume off on my phone. Hey, Stacy. Welcome. Welcome, welcome. I literally, y'all, look, like my back of my head is still wet. Like, I seriously got out of the shower like 15 minutes ago. Honestly. My hair's still wet, but I had to get, like, these pieces here and, like, here. Like, I had to put a straightener through them real quick because if not, they would have been, like, frizzy by the time I got done. So, yeah. Looking a little hay rough this morning or this afternoon. Evening, night, whatever it is. Hey, Tabitha. How are you? All right, let me get some rose water up on this face because I don't, do you see this redness? Do you see this redness? Yeah. Let's get some rose water going. Oh. Just give me a minute. Breathe deep. Breathe out. Breathe deep. Breathe out. I'm telling you, this rose water Oh my gosh. I honestly think that if it did nothing for me, like if it had no properties that benefited my skin at all, I would still use it. Just because it smells amazing. Like it smells like I just walked through a rose garden. That's what it is. All right, let me get these bangs back because they're going to get on my nerves if not. So excuse the do, okay, because... The dude just got got showered, and um, you know how I, I was like going to get in the shower after I made that post. I was like, I'll get in the shower real quick and get my hair dried and straightened before I even go live. I got in the shower, and I'm like, oh, this feels so good. And, ooh, this sm soap smells so good. I just got some new bath soap from Bath and Body Works. Smells so good. So I was like not wanting to get out at all. My fault. Totally my fault. But it's okay. But I got some new lotion too. It's focus lotion aromatherapy. And I'm just trying it because I have a hard time focusing as you all, all know. Because I got lupus brain. And sometimes not even lupus is the call sometimes it's just me being ridiculous 
So, did I ever share this? I think I did. Am I like totally, because on here I'm totally froze up. Okay, no, there it goes. It was like, I guess it was my computer, but when I went to hit the like share button for my live to my personal wall instead of in my group, it was showing like I was frozen. Frozen in time. Lord, do I only wish my skin was frozen in time. <laughs> that would be sweet. Okay, good. I'm glad that I'm not, I wasn't frozen. Because I was getting ready to think, man, I am getting ready to have to start all over again. Let me grab this and pull this all back. So, girls, let's just discuss that I got the kudos in today. Yeah, and I'm super excited about it. Because, whoa, they are so pretty. Like... Oh my gosh, so pretty. So, we're going to use the kudos tonight. But let me just show you just how pretty this is. Like, I knew they were pretty. I knew they were pretty. And I've been wanting them. But, oh my gosh. Look at that. Yeah, I, I swatched this one and this one earlier today. So you can totally see that I've been in it because it, it was me. I totally was in it. Oh my gosh. So beautiful, pretty. And they're 90% sold out. I was so glad I got one when I did. I kind of hesitated at first. So when I finally ordered it, oh my gosh, I couldn't wait for it to get here. I loved it when it first came out, but you know, some colors like look good on some people and not on others. And I was thinking, man, is this really going to be a color that looks good on me? And then I thought, you know, only if I, if I, even if I get it for just one or two colors, because they're never coming back. You know what I mean? Like it's going to be a one time only thing. So I thought, well, only if I, even if I get it for just one color or two colors, even if I don't use them all. I mean, they're never coming back. I'm never going to see them again. And I'll know, I know how I am. I would totally regret not getting it, you know? So I did. Whoa, am I glad that I did. Because then you get a, um, you get a crease brush in with it. But then you get a lip bonbon for free. So, and the lip bonbons are awesome for winter time like oh my goodness awesome for winter time so yeah i'm just gonna put on some um time correcting moisturizer here oh, love this stuff my skin stays so dry in the winter time that it's really hard for me to find a good moisturizer that will like keep especially like my t-zone right in here and across here stay so dry in the winter time that it's really hard for me to find a good moisturizer. Taylor, thank you, but oh my gosh, do you see all this? Like really? Girl, I did not take care of my skin at all when I was like teenager, you know, I was in the tanning bed, I was in the sun, never wearing sunscreen. Yeah, well, plus I'm old. But thank you so much for the compliment. Because, oh, Taylor, thank you. But I have age spots and sunspots and oh my goodness. But I'm telling you, it's gotten so much better since I started using, like, I had a good skincare. Like, my good skincare. Like, I use my rose water and I use my my beauty serum and I use the time correcting night cream. And it's gotten so much better since I started using good products. 
It's amazing. And I was, I'm going to be honest, like I was never one of those people that ever believed like, not that I didn't believe in skincare because I did, but I didn't believe that if you, like you got what you paid for. Do you know what I mean? Like I always went to Walmart or even Dollar General, Family Dollar, and got whatever. You know what I mean? Like I never invested in myself and I never invested in my makeup and Ah, and oh my goodness, so glad that I started because it's gotten, I've only been using, um, I never, hold on, let me get this, okay, I couldn't, st I had to keep stopping to try and put my stuff on, um, but yeah, like I never believed it either, so I was never... I always just did whatever, you know, like I ever always just bought whatever and so, but it makes the biggest difference in the world. Oh, well, I know what I was going to say. I've only been using the skincare for, let's see, what is this, February? Um, like the end of September? I think is when I got it. Either the end of September or the earliest of early October. So, yeah, like a few months. It's amazing. It's amazing. All right. So, if you're new to my video, my name is Stephanie and I'm an independent presenter with Unique. Um, I was supposed to pin my site. Let me try and do that now. Um, all the products you'll be seeing me use tonight are from Unique. You can get those on my website. If you have questions, please message me. Even while I'm live, I won't be able to answer them while I'm live, but I will answer them as soon as we're done. Um, there should be a Lev, a Lev Rob video, <laughs> a red live button above my head somewhere in that area. If you see that there, then you are catching the live video. And if not, then you are catching the replay. If, you, if you're actually catching the replay, put in hashtag replay so that I know that I missed you. Um, and then I will be able to come back and chat with you or say hello and thank you for watching. Going hard drinks tonight, girls. Hard drinks. Me and my good old Coca-Cola. All right. So let's get this party started, shall we? Shall we? Shall we? Okay. I'm going to... So yesterday, I was washing a knife. Do you see what I did to myself? Like, I totally filleted my thumb. Hi, Catriona. Hello. Okay, so I totally filleted the side of my thumb. Okay, I know it's not deep, and I know that it doesn't look that bad, but oh my gosh, did it hurt. Okay, just going to say it. Did it hurt? So, I have before taken that, like, flap of skin off, and then, like, oh my gosh, hurt for days. Like, it would hurt so bad for days. Let me turn this volume off on my laptop so that it doesn't keep dinging in my ear. Um, so I just left the skin on and my husband's like, you need to trim that off. I'm like, uh-uh, uh-uh. This is, this is going to be protecting me. So now every time I do something, like I hit it and it, you know, never fails. Like when you do something to yourself, you hit it 45 times just so you can hurt just a little bit more than you did already. Yeah. All right, girls, so tomorrow's going to be the day that I give away um, some prizes. So if you will hit that share button in one of those two corners that it's on for you and then put shared in the comments, I can um, add you into the share drawing for tomorrow. And I'll be giving away a couple of different things because I haven't done a share drawing for a while. So share this video up. This is going to be your last chance to get an entry into that into that giveaway. So let's do that. Do that, do that. All right, so now that I have on my rose water, my beauty serum, my moisturizer, let's do some foundation. Let's do some foundation. No, let's do some primer. It's a crime not to prime, girls. It's a crime not to prime. 
All right. So primer. Thanks for sharing, Marka. Thanks for sharing, Hannah. So primer, if you are not currently using a primer, I would suggest that you use a primer because any fine lines or wrinkles that you have, it's going to fill those in. Um, if you have large pores, it helps to um, mask those. Then it's going to create that barrier. Thanks for sharing, Tabitha. Um, it's going to create that barrier between your face and the actual products that you're using. So it's going to cut down on any breakouts that you have. Um, because we all know breakouts come from stuff trapped in your pores and things that are not good for your skin and dirt and that type of thing. So not only is it going to be protected from the makeup, but anything else that comes in contact with your face as well. So it's always good. Plus, I just found this out. You can use this primer. Now, I don't know about all primers, but I know you this say for this primer. But you can use this primer. It's like I when I straighten my hair, okay, I'll get like little ends that sometimes are not as smooth that I, that I want them to be. Um, and you can use a little bit of primer on those ends and run it through. Works like magic. Works like magic. Let me grab something real quick. Where's that brush? Okay, so sorry. Hi, Marty. Welcome. Um, I was looking for a brush. A, a brush that I just got, but I can't seem to locate it. I think it's in my purse, which is in the other room. It's not that big of a deal, so. So this is Liquid Foundation. Liquid Foundation. This liquid foundation dries to a powder finish, and its nickname is Liquid Gold because it is literally good as gold. Honestly, before I um before I started using Unique products, even actually even before I knew about Unique products, I had quit using liquid foundation altogether because. If everything I used was so thick and so hot that I couldn't stand it. I was just like, and I'm a very kind of warm nature person anyway. So, especially in the summertime, I was like, oh no, can't be doing all that. You know what I mean? Like it was just horrible. So I quit using it and I couldn't find a kind that I liked that didn't make me look cakey and it didn't make me look crazy and I... Regardless, I couldn't find a kind that I liked. So, I quit using it. And I started just only using either loose or pressed powder. as like a foundation base. And then, but I wasn't getting, you know, looser powder, I mean, a pressed powder foundation is great if that's what you like. But I wasn't getting the coverage that I wanted. So, are y'all seeing this craziness? That's what I that's what I get for trying to go live with wet hair. It's totally what I get for trying to go live with wet hair. Cuz it's going to be in my face all night long. Oh, just excuse me for a moment. So anyway, um loose powder or pressed powder is great. It just didn't have the coverage that I wanted. So I had to um I might have used it because I didn't think there was an alternative. You know what I mean? Like, I didn't think that I was going to find a liquid foundation. I hadn't up to that point. So, I have a friend who had seen somebody do a live video that was using Unique and loved it. And so, they sent me um, a little, like, I mean, it wasn't even, like, a sample, but it wasn't even enough for, like, a face. Like, it was just enough for me to see if I liked it. I thought I had 
I think I busted a little bit of my... Anyway, bust got a red spot in my eye. Um, so, I uh, tried it and I was like, wow, this is really good stuff. Like, it, I could tell that it was going to give me the coverage that I wanted. Plus, I could tell that it was thin. And I was like, man... So I had her, um, she had actually ordered some at that point. So I used some of hers and I was like, oh my gosh, this is like silk. And it is, I, I still just absolutely love it because it's just so thin and you don't even realize you're wearing anything. And plus it dries to a powder finish so it doesn't stay like real thick on your skin um, like a normal liquid foundation does. So it's really good. Really, really, really good. Okay, saw something flash. Just want to make sure I wasn't um, missing anything important there. Okay, I hate when um, when I'm live and I get messages from like my people, my girls, like you guys, or um, customers needing something, or you know, I just I can't stand to not be right there so that I can give an answer as quick as possible. So, hey Jessica. All right, so I'm gonna use. This is um, setting powder that kind of helps to set that foundation that I just put on. Driving home. Are you coming home from um, the competition tonight? Congratulations to Sheridan and her team, by the way. That's great. I'm glad they did so well. So those of you that weren't here earlier, I literally got out of the shower about five or ten minutes before I came live and my hair is still kind of wet. So ignore this craziness. My hair wise, I mean, because it's, whoa. But that's what I get when I try to, I was getting in the shower and I was like, oh, I can go, I can go, um, get in the shower before, you know, whatever. I could, if I didn't love the shower and I didn't, you know, bask in all that warmthness in there. <laughs> so, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, I'm doing the kudos tonight. For those of you that didn't hear that earlier, I'm doing the kudos and I'm so excited because I finally got them in. They're so pretty. Such pretty colors. Now I'm just using some bronzer. That's another thing. If you're not bronzing or using bronzer in your life, uh, what are you waiting for? Just going to say it. What are you waiting for? Because bronzer is life, especially in the wintertime. Love my bronzer. I just put on like um, kind of a light sun kiss. It's called sun kiss, actually. Um, or is that what it is? Sunset. Sunset color all over my face and then I go back and I contour with something a little bit darker. Okay, so. Oh, thanks, Jessica. So I'm gonna use Hermosa, which is a little bit of a shade darker. And then I'm gonna pinch my brush. I'm gonna go right here, lining up at the top of my ear to my mouth and contour and this is just putting my face on a diet real quick gotta love the diets for the face okay like the face facial diets are amazing because ultimately you just don't have to refrain from food you just can eat whatever you want and you still just lose weight it's amazing like, I wish I had a diet for my whole body that way. <laughs> I 
And then I always just line my forehead. And then right below my jawline. And underneath, right about my double chin. Just kind of creating a shadow. So that you kind of hide all that mumbo jumbo mess up underneath there. Because, you know, I ain't trying to love it. Oh, yeah, Jessica, it shouldn't be, um, I can check on shipping, but I shouldn't be too much longer, I wouldn't think. Okay, and since I have done these lines, Aw, uh, thanks, Marty. Good night. I hope you sleep well. All right, so it's the big I have these lines. I got to blend this out a little bit. Babe. Yeah. Can you turn that out a little bit? Yeah. Thank you. He's watching TV, and the TV is like the walls. This is the room that I'm in. The door shut, but the TV's on this wall, and my office is right here. Like they have, we share a wall. So it's kind of hard because it's like I can hear every, I can hear better than he can't, you know, <laughs> even though the door shut. So I'm just going to take my powder brush. That looked a little crazy, didn't it? Powder brush. And I'm just going to go on the top line and on the bottom line and on the top line and on the bottom line. And I just don't want to make it as dramatic. Top line and bottom, top and bottom. Yeah. Then I'm gonna do it up here a little bit. Blend that in a little bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. And I'm gonna grab that brush that I was just using. I'm gonna go back to that sunset color that I use for my all over my face. Pinching the brush again. And I'm gonna run it right down the side of my nose. And this is to contour your nose and give your nose some definition. Do you see the difference? It's crazy, right? It's craziness right here. I love this nose contouring. Because it just gives you, I don't know, like some definition and some, I don't know. But I love it. All right. And I'm also going to do the same, pinching underneath here. And basically, I just made that lip pouty. You'll be able to see a lot difference when I um, put my lipstick on. In a little bit. Alright, let's do some blush. And I'm going to do some Spirited, which is our limited edition blush that's absolutely my favorite. I love it. Love it, love it. Our blushes are so pigmented, though, so if you've never used one, make sure and shake off the excess because you will have... I, I've done it, okay? I did it, done it, been there. And see, I still will have to blend that a little. Oh, my nose. Every time I use that found that blush brush, it gets me. Every time, every time, every time. Okay. So, most of you all know that, hey Isabella, how are you? So, most of you all know that my husband fell months ago with his work on his job and had a severe concussion and um, broke his nose. So, I have no, none at all experience with like concussions or um, 
I'm just trying to get like different opinions on, oh, thank you, darling. You're so sweet. Um, if anybody has any like, because he's truly still suffering. And it's been, it, it was eight weeks on Friday. Um, memories, it's getting worse. If not, if it's not getting better, it's definitely getting worse. Um, it got it better initially and now it's getting worse. Like it's been getting worse for the last several weeks. Um, but it's scary. And I, I know that I, I have some friends that have, um, had concussions and that type of thing. Oh, I'm just all the time forgetting my primer anymore. Forgot my eye primer. All right. So sorry. Just derailed that whole situation. Put it back on the track. But anyway, I just didn't know if anybody had any information or any personal experiences or anything like that. Because I'm just trying to get different opinions on... We go actually to the um, UofL Concussion Clinic on Monday. And I'm hoping that we might have a few answers, maybe a little bit anyway. Hopefully. Because it's been... It's pretty trying and I would forget my head if it wasn't attached tonight I was not gonna do my eyebrows either girls you all need to be like hey you forgot something I mean what are y'all here for anyway spectators you think you're here to do nothing but watch just kidding I'm gonna need you to start participating okay I'm gonna need you to get off, get off of lunch break, and do something around here, girls. So I'm just using a little spoily to brush out the brows to make them lay better, because if I don't do this, my brows will go cray cray. So I have to try and brush them. Brush up, brush up, brush up. I always think of that movie when I do when I say brush them, like the Grease movie, where she sings that song about brushing the teeth, and I don't know. <laughs> just ignore. <laughs> totally, just ignore me, okay? Totally ignore me. All right, I'm gonna use the brow palette, like I always do. I'm going to use some wax up on these babies. And just get them to lay down a little bit. Layer on down there. Because my brows are, are cray. Like, literally. They're cray. And they try to go every direction but the direction they're supposed to be in. All right, girls, so let's do this. And All right, girls, we got some serious business to talk about. There's been several of you, or I've gotten several messages, I guess I should say, um, about joining my team. The kit special that's going on right now is only going to last until the end of this month. So, like, the 28th. So, you've got, like, what? What is today? 16th? Um, 12 more days? Sorry. Math was not my strong point. Not at all my strong point. So, yeah. Right now, you have two kits to choose from. They give you, um, 
points for Cancun. Monica, give me just a second and I will answer that question for you. But yes, I do. Um, but right now they give you points for Cancun. You get two kits to choose from. Um, they're going to throw in some Y cash for you to have free product, any kind of free product you want. Um, the points for Cancun are like, um, yeah, like I want to just join again so I can get those points. Because girl needs all the points hers can get. Okay? Just saying. Alright. So, Monica. Mine used to be, and they still are not what they're getting ready to be. You'll see what I'm getting ready to do. But mine um, used to be worse than they are right now. Okay? And I started using... Well, where's my lash serum? Oh, there it is. This this serum. Okay? This serum is, it's called Lash Serum. It's for your eyelashes, but you can use it on your eyebrows, okay? I took some medication a while back for my lupus that has totally, my hair fell out. I mean, hair falls out with lupus anyway, but the medication made it worse. So, hair, my hair fell, some of my hair fell out. My eyelashes were pretty like here and there and just not even together. I had holes in my brows. Plus, with my brows, I'm an overplucker. So I will get with the tweezers and be like all up in my, all up in my mirror. I have them in my car. I have them in my desk. I have them in my purse, my bathroom. I mean, the, like it's bad. I have like an addiction to plucking. Okay. Like if there is an addiction out there for plucking, I have it. And I don't know what it's called, but I'm sure it's pluckers. Pluckers Anonymous. Like I, I need it. Anyway, I had plucked, it was this one, so bad one time that I had a hole right here because I was trying to correct something like I was plucking and I jacked it up and then tried to correct it and made it worse and I had a hole. Not good. Not good at all. So I used this and I now have brows and I have my lashes are coming back. Um, my lashes came back. And so, but they continue to get better. This stuff is great. Now, it lasts forever. I have had this literally over six months and I bet it still has half a tube. And I use it, not real faithfully, but I try to use it morning and night. And I, I use it at least once a day. You're supposed to use it twice, but I use it at least once. Now, there's a couple of options. That's one, okay? Then I have this brow palette, and I know it looks like a jacked up mess because I use it. But this is filling brows in. This is wax that helps you kind of, um, and you can see it's tinted. So that's what I've done right now is I've put on some wax to help it lay down, okay? But this is colors, um, two colors that you can fill in with, and these are both highlighters that you can use. Or we also have the... Um, brow pencil, which I had, um, I used to use just the brow pencil only. Um, and it works great too. I just happened to really like the brow palette better. But before I started, uh, before I was able to get the brow palette, I used just the pencil and it works great too. Um, but I keep this around because it has that great spoilie on the end so that I can brush them through and get them to lay right. So there's several different options. Um, I would, Personally, would if it was me, I would use the serum and either the brow pencil or the brow palette until you got them where you want them. Um, I always liked mine darker than they, what they are, so I kind of always would fill them in anyway. So, it's up to you. Oh, Barbara. And you know, here's the thing. I used to not be as bad as I am today. Like, I used to, not, I used to hate it. I would go and make whoever was cutting my hair... Like I would make them, um, I would make them wax them because I couldn't stand it. Drove me crazy. Plucking used to hurt me. Um, but then I think, I, I don't know what happened. I don't know what changed in me, but I got to where I, like, I just, I love it. I love plucking. I don't know what it is. 
You're welcome, Monica. If you have any other questions, you let me know. Or I can help you get it ordered. You just send me a message and we can get you hooked up, girlfriend. All right, so that's this first color here. Okay, and I'm just using just like a, this is an eye brush. It has a sponge on one end and it's a brush on the other. Um, and I'll just use that. We have a brow brush. I just have never gotten it. Um, probably should invest in that. But this brush really, really works. This is kind of how I learned to use this palette was with this brush. So I think I've just stuck with what I know, you know. Sometimes it's hard, like, sometimes you should branch out. And I just, I, I have a hard time branching out sometimes. But I do not use that darker color that you that you saw on there. I only use the lighter one. Because my hair is light, so I don't, um, I don't want them real, real dark. I just like them you know, to be darker than what they are. Sorry, I was starting to, um, to get blurry. And then I always go back and kind of box them in a little bit. So I use, this is a liner brush. It's really, really thin. You'll see what I mean. Brows are not very hard to do either. They're not very hard to learn. I didn't, I've only been doing brows probably a year or two maybe. Like not very long. But once I started, like I was like, okay. Because I saw the big change that it made in my look. I, uh, I was like, you know, once you, once you do something once or twice and you see that it's so great and that the biggest difference is made, you're like, oh yeah, I'm doing that forever. You know, <laughs> why didn't I do this a long time ago? That was me. That was me with brows. All right, so now what I'm going to do is use that lighter color highlighter and I'm going to go right on top of them and just highlight them. Basically, to get them to blend a little bit. And to tone them down just a little, not a whole, whole lot, just enough. And you'll notice too, that just like hair, like you'll have good brow days and bad brow days. Yeah, it totally happens. Totally, totally happens. I think I just messed this one up. The good thing about this though is once it gets set using this palette or the brush or the pencil, once you get set with these, like they're on there for a few minutes, you're good to go. Like if you could get rained on and it's not gonna go anywhere. Oh, thank you, Barbara. I promise you it's not it's not silk though. <laughs> it's not even close. I wish it was. Um It's just these this makeup makes you just look I mean I honestly somebody um today um one of the ladies that I haven't seen for a while and see, you all, can you see this? This is going to be an issue. Like, this brow is going to be an issue tonight. Um, but this lady I know I haven't seen for a while, she put a comment on my wall today and said, on my Facebook wall, and said, your profile picture is beautiful. Like, I love it. It's gorgeous. You look amazing. And I'm like, 
thank you. You know, I really appreciate that. And then she said um, something about, oh, she said that I looked, you know, so great and young or whatever. And I said, um, wish it was, wish it was me, but it's not. It's the makeup I use, you know, because it totally has changed everything in me. And uh, she was like, what is it? I got to know. Like, yeah, well, well, let me just tell you about it. Because I'm in the business of making the world feel better about themselves. That's why I started doing Unique to begin with. And that's honestly really, really true. Um, I started using the products and was like, man, this stuff, like my confidence and self-esteem went through the roof. My husband was even commenting on it. He's like, my gosh, like I can tell that you feel so much better about yourself. And I'm like, you do. Like, I know that I don't need makeup to look pretty. And I get that. I mean, I, I love myself whether I have makeup on or not. But it made me feel so much better. Like I was put together. I was ready for the day. You know, whatever. And I just, I made a big difference in me. So I'm like, you know, I, somebody asked me to join their team. And I was like, you know, I literally want every woman in the world to feel the difference in themselves that I have felt in myself. Because it's so just amazing. The feeling's just amazing just amazing okay so I'm gonna use Victoria's splurge cream shadow and this is it's an eyeshadow okay um this is called Victoria's and it is a cream eyeshadow dries to a powder finish so I'm gonna use this as just like a base color something to go just kind of on the bottom All right, I need to clean this brush because there's stuff. Oh, yeah. Okay, so we have this amazing brush cleaner that is oil-based, so you don't have to wait for your brushes to dry, and it's amazing. It comes in a little bottle like this, and I've had this since before Christmas. Oh, literally, it was a Black Friday deal, so right before Christmas. Still have it, and all you do is spray your brush, rub it on a paper towel, rub the stuff out of it, and you have a sparkling clean brush. And wait, you don't have to wait for it to dry because it's not wet, it's amazing, and I love it. Love it, love it, love it. Literally, like the first few days I had it, I used it every day on every brush I've used. Like, I just was so in love with it, I couldn't stand it. I'm like, yep, I'm going to use the whole bottle. <laughs> I love it that much. It was awesome. Awesome sauce. Okay, so you can totally see that it gives you just a good base of color. Okay. I'm going to do the same to the other eye. Let me move my hair first. So, um, last night, I, we were planning, my husband and I were planning to... Um, do hubby hubby does the glam so if you're new to my videos my hub my husband does my makeup we try to do it um, we haven't been able to do it in a little bit because he's been um, hurt but we were hoping to do it last night um, we try to do it every Friday night at 9 p.m. he does my makeup and it's atrocious and for the life of me, I haven't yet figured out why I subject myself to this. But everybody seems to love it. We have a good time, so we do it. But I look like a horse's butt. Okay? Or as my best friend would say, I look like a donkey. <laughs> I 
I totally look like a donkey by the time he gets done with me. I, one time he, we got done and I could have went out in the front yard and done a rain dance because I had so many lines on my face. He doesn't believe in blending. Doesn't at all believe in blending. So let me tell you. Yeah. Could have walked right out in my front yard and done the right there. It probably would have rained on me while I was in the front yard. It was so bad. I could have died. I could not get my shine wipes out of my drawer and into the bathroom quick enough. It was horrible. Anyway, we were going to do that last night. And um, as some of you all know, my cat broke her leg. It was eight weeks ago. So right around the time that my husband hurt himself, my cat broke her leg. Yeah, when it rains, of course. So anyway, we went and had our cast taken off of her. So I go, I mean, we did a, a few things around here. I was trying to come in here and get things ready for the live video. Make sure I have everything I needed up and set up and ready. Because it had been a few, a few weeks since we had done that because since he's been hurt. So, um, sorry, just brushing through these to make sure they're laying correctly because I'm seeing they're looking kind of crazy. Um, so yeah, I go back into the, into the living room. My cat, um, who I had her, I have two cats. The one cat who had her cast taken off was sitting there at the bowl of water and there was stuff like around her. And at the vet... When he took the cast off, the vet said, you know, there's glue on there. You'll see that. There was because her leg looked kind of weird. He said, that's glue from the cast. She'll work that out. She'll clean herself up. I'm like, okay. No. My cat. My cat totally just was pulling and pulling the hair out. So, like, cat emergency because my pets are my babies okay my husband and I don't have any kids yet so my my cats and our dog are our kids like it was emergency so I came into here in my office and was like crying I'm like oh my gosh what are we gonna do my husband's from a farming family he's grew up that way knows all about animals so he's in there like, what are you doing, Bella? Stop, you know, like picking her up, looking at her. He's like, babe, it's not as bad as it looks. I'm like, what? What do you mean? Her hair's gone. He's like, no, her hair's not gone. He said her hair is down to like the, the layer right above her bare skin. He said she's cleaning herself up. And I'm like, but I didn't know cleaning herself up meant she was going to pull her hair out. He's like, well, I don't think the vet did either. But that's her way of cleaning herself. So we have some spray stuff like that you'd use on animals. That's like an antibiotic, um, like a spray. So we got it out. And I, after I gathered myself together, <laughs> and literally this happened like 10 minutes before we were supposed to go live. So I got myself together from crying and being upset. And I went out there and I like soaked her leg down in this stuff and made sure she was okay. And I, oh, she's fine. She's going to be perfect. But it's so traumatic when something like I even told my husband, I'm like, you know, if we ever have kids, if we're ever blessed and the Lord blesses us enough to have children, Lord, give me strength because I don't even know. Like this is my pet. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know. It was traumatic. Let's just say that. So that's why we didn't go live last night because we had family or yeah, family emergency. <laughs> so here's the palette we're going to be using tonight on my eyes. And this is the beloved kudos palette. That is the customer special for this month. Um, these colors are OMG. 
Sorry about the shadow on my head. Um, but these colors are amazing. I'm going to be using this color and then we'll go from there. Could get interesting. This is called Alluring. I'm using a blending brush, which yes, you typically would use to blend with. I use a lot of times to put on my eyeshadow with. And just going to work it this way. And to me, it goes on really smooth with this brush. I love this brush. Um, I used to put it on and then try to blend it out. To me, it works like butter if you put it on with this brush. It's amazing. I love, and I'm loving these colors. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, yeah. So let me just put it over here in this corner. Look how pretty that is. Like I'm not sure that you guys are gonna get the full, the full effect. Just gotta blend and blend and blend. And if you are using brushes to put your stuff on with, um, the I found that if you use, hey Kayla, oh, long story, I'll text you <laughs> after this is over. So if you hold this brush toward the end, you have much more control. And it's not just this brush, but any brush you're using, if you use it, you have much more control. And I know it sounds crazy because when I first started doing that, I was like, there's no way you have more control at the end. Oh yeah, you totally do. You totally do. Oh my gosh, I'm in love with these colors. This is going to be so pretty when I get done. I like to just kind of pull it in on the sides over here. Oh, Kayla, it doesn't matter. I don't mind to text you. Um, it was just, uh, um, I didn't want everybody else to have to hear it all over again. <laughs> it's no big deal. Just some family drama with me and my pets. Okay. Now, girls, I think I'm going to use this Adored. Which is like a lightish pink. This is like a whitish metallic. And this is a pink. If you can see that. It's a very, very light pink. I think I'm going to use a little bit of it. But I'm going to use my shader brush to put it on with. Just going to clean this brush up real quick. Because I use it to highlight a lot with. And I just need to make sure I don't have anything else in it. That's why this brush cleaner is amazing to use. I love it. Okay. Until I know the color, I'm just going to put a little bit here. Okay. Until I know, like, what kind of pigment I'm working with. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Girls. How pretty is that? So, so pretty.
Yes, Kayla, they are. They're gorgeous, are they not? Like, whoa. This is 90% sold out, too. In all markets. So, like, my company is um, worldwide. And we are 90% sold out of this kudos in all markets. So, like, once it's gone, there is no coming back. Kayla, I'm blue. I am blue. Why is that looking different? Is it because I can't figure it out? Like, it looks pinker over here for some reason. There we go. Oh, yes, Barbara. I'm loving this. It's so pretty. And you get this palette okay each one of these is normally $29 so one two three four each one of these is normally $29 as a press shadow and you get a crease brush a brand new crease brush and a lip bonbon which is like a tinted moisture lip moisturizer and you can have it in any color you want so this one right here is, yeah, rose, raspberry cheesecake. It's like a pinky, pinky pink, but it's just like a tinted moisturizer. So it's not, um, it's not like real drastic. You know what I mean? This one, I just, this was the one I just got, cherry cobbler. So it's not like real pigmented, but it's so pretty. Um, Kayla, it is, it's just your level pretty much. Um, it's just a way for you, for people to know how far you're moving up the ladder, that type of thing. Um, like you start out as a white, well, when you become a presenter, once you either purchase or sell $125, you go to white status then you go to pink status after so many things are done. And then you can go to, no, I'm sorry, white and then yellow and then pink and then blue. And then elite is the top 2% of the country. I mean the company and that's green. So I am blue one step right below elite. And I'm so excited about it. Can we just talk about how excited I am about it? I'm just kidding. All right, so now I'm going to use this Unwavering. This is the whitish color, and I'm going to use my sponge brush to throw some of this on. And I need a mirror, so let me grab my brow palette here. Let's see what I'm doing. And I'm just going to throw this in the corner here and pull it out. Kind of something I always try to live by with makeup is less is more, number one. And then number two, start small. So like you can start with a little bit of product on your brush. You can always add more to your eyes, your cheeks, what have you. But you, it's really hard to take away and not start completely all over. So if you don't take anything else from this live... Please take that less is more. Especially with our um, our products because they're so pigmented. They're a whole lot more pigmented than a lot of other eyeshadows and companies that I've used. So to me, when I first started using these, I was like, you know, I was like, 
I had stuff everywhere because I was so used to whatever company that I used to used to use. Sorry, I'm I just don't I'm not into bashing other companies. This is not what I'm here for, so I don't I usually try not to say names of whoever I'm talking about. Okay. I'm gonna use um, because these colors are so pretty, I don't want to take anything away from them. So I'm going to use this just soft brown liner. And do some. Oh, Kayla, I am excited. My success, I, I'm very excited. It's just, um, I don't, I don't like bashing other companies. It's just not how I roll. Yeah, I got it. I don't know what that was. So I'm just softly using the eyeliner. Because I don't like my eyes without any kind of, any eyeliner. Um, I feel like something's just missing if I don't use any eyeliner. And I'm going to use this white on the bottom. And this will just make your eyes be pop some. It also will make them peer, appear, I can't even talk, it will make them peer, it will make your eyes appear a little bit larger. All right. Now, before I move on, I'm going to do some under eye liner. You are going, what? So I'm using this liner brush, same one I've been using. I'm going to use that alluring, this color that I used on the outside of my eye. And I'm going under the lash line. I don't know why that blood vessel busted in my eye. Oh. Hard to tell with me. Hard to tell. Oh. Sorry, I totally was lost on that. I'm so sorry, Kayla. That's what happens. See, there's such a um there's such a lag. My mind is shut. There's such a lag with 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 where I am and where the comments come in so that I don't ever know like I it's hard for me sometimes if I'm not totally right on top of the conversation it's totally hard for me all right now that I had this liner on I'm gonna go back and just kind of blend it out a little yes Beautiful. I love this kudos. 
I love this kudos and I can't sing so don't listen to me all right this is epic mascara if you've never seen or heard of epic mascara hello what rock have you been under I'm just kidding I'm totally kidding let's do some epic mascara girls I love me some epic mascara. I don't know why I don't talk when I put my mascara on. I literally am like in another world. I just, I'm so picky about my lashes that it's like I go into a trance. And it's not a good trance. <laughs> Okay, girls, look at that. That is one coat of Epic Mascara. Like, what? I'm not kidding to you. When I started just, thanks, Debbie, when I first started using this product, I was like, you are everything I've ever wanted in mascara. Like, I... <clears throat> literally died and went to heaven when I found this because I for so long searched high and low for a mascara that would make me my eyes look like my lashes look fuller longer you know what I mean like it just totally it changed my life My eyes are blue, but they're totally looking green right now. Totally looking green. You also don't have to um, curl your lashes when you use this mascara because it does it for you. I totally took out a whole step of my getting ready process. No, actually two whole steps because it will separate and curl. I know. It's like magic in a bottle. I get it. And truly, hard to believe. If I didn't use it, I probably would say, I don't believe it. There is no such thing on this earth. Oh, but there is. Let me just say, there totally, totally is. All right, now I'm going to dry these babies, and I'm going to give it another coat. Okay, so what we do to dry is we use our blow dryer. No, I'm not crazy, or maybe I am, but I just blow up, okay? And here's why. If I was to start using another, another coat, and this is any kind of mascara for me, you start getting clumping. You start getting stick together. We don't want that. We want a good array of beautiful lashes. So if you gotta dry them, then put it on, you should be good to go.
and I'm just blowing upward. And I just do it a few times on each eye for a few seconds to make sure that I've gotten the whole thing. Woo! Blow, draw me away. All right. So now I can go back for a second coat because they're dry. But on the second one, you're going to want to go from the middle lash out to the ends because ultimately you have mascara on all your lashes at this point. You just need the lengthening. Okay, so let's talk about something. Who has questions about the makeup, about the business, about the kits, about having a party? Oh, because you know what? Right now I have an incentive on having parties. Just saying. My husband is out there straight up asleep and I can totally hear him snoring. And like always, I said, babe, are you tired? Oh, just a little bit. I said, how about you just go on to bed? No, no, I'm not going to go to sleep. Girls, sawing logs out there, okay? Like, oh my, sawing logs. Can y'all hear him snoring? Y'all, it gets on my nerves. Like, honestly. Like, I literally just asked you. Are y'all seeing this mascara? I mean, I'm just wondering. Are y'all seeing that mascara? Because I totally am seeing this mascara. Kayla, message me. You can, there's a couple of different ways. Um, you can have it on Facebook. You can have it um, in home or at a location. Um... If you're local, you can have it at a location. I guess people out of state probably wouldn't want to do it at a location here. But, um, like, most people do it on Facebook, like a virtual. But it's kind of however you want to, really. But it's a great way to get free and half price items. Um... It's a great way to get Y-Cash, which is used for free products. So if you have a wish list of some sort that you haven't been able to get. Um, plus, parties are a lot of fun. A lot of fun. I'm sorry, girls. I go into a trance when I do my lashes.
Because there's nothing I hate worse than a bunch of clumped up eyelashes. Is Kayla really the only person that has a question? I mean, really. Let's get for real. And Kayla. Is that the only question you have? I'm just kidding. I'm kidding to all of you. I'll do it, Kayla. Sure, no problem. Okay. So this wet head that I came on live with is starting to dry now. <laughs> Surprised I don't have a big frizzy ball on top of my head. Because that's normally what happens. A big frizzy ball. Let's do some lips. I don't know what lipstick I want to use. What color y'all think? Pink? Red? Nude. Ooh, what about that? That's pretty, right? That's pretty. Or this is a nude. That's also pretty. I like it. I like it. Or we could do like a lip gloss. Like a pink lip gloss or a nude lip gloss or a red lip gloss okay so let's discuss this if you think I should do this Give me a thumbs up. Okay? Thumbs up. If you think I should do this nude, this nude, hearts. Okay? Or a number one, if you think red lip gloss. Okay, so let's go over this again. Thumbs up. Okay. Hearts. Or a number one in the comments for red. Yes, overwhelming hearts. I hear you, girls. I hear you. All right, so nude it is. So let me get some liner. I'm gonna use some pouty lip liner. I always do the X right here. To kind of help with that cupid's bow. Ooh, guys. Good choice. Because with such a dramatic eye, like the eyes just need to speak for themselves. You know what I mean? I'm digging it, guys. I'm digging it. Digging it, digging it, digging it. Now let's do some highlighting real quick. 
And I'm going to use um, Optimistic Pressed Shadow. Which the kudos that I use tonight are pressed shadows. They just come in a palette. Um, but I use, this is going to be Optimistic. This is what I use just about every time to um, highlight. And I'm going to use this amazing crease brush because let's just face it, it's just amazing. But I just do that to kind of get that line to go away. And to kind of blend that out a little bit. Oh, thank you, Barbara. But I promise you, it's not me. <laughs> These products make it so easy to number one, apply, and number two, look amazing. I mean, like I honestly, when I started using Unique, um, I was a pressed powder mascara eyeliner girl. Like I did nothing else. And being in this company will make your makeup game come to life. So not only is it the products, but the company as well. But um, because the products are so much fun, you know, so much fun. I do that there to kind of make that my eyes kind of stand out a little bit. And I think I'm going to put some more blush on since I kind of blended all that out. Yes, gorge. Nice, I'm loving it. All right, guys. Well, thanks so much for hanging out with me. Don't forget, if you want to have a party, join my join my team. Um, want the kudos if you need help picking out stuff you let me know message me i'm always here to help you no matter what we will be here for you <laughs> so like a bad slogan didn't it all right guys i'm gonna run thanks so much for hanging out with me on this late night saturday night live and i hope to see you guys again soon love you each from the bottom of my heart and i will see you soon